Check out IG Vault for the cheapest NBA Live mobile coins. Click the link in the description and use the code Bobby for 6% off. What's up, ballers? It's Bobby Buckets back with another episode of NBA Live Mobile. So as you guys can see, we got a little bit of a different setup. I got a new mic stand and also just got an Elgato capture card because we got an Xbox, which means 2K is coming soon. I'm going to try this out. There might be some problems with quality, different stuff, but hopefully overall everything is still good. Um, we've also got some fluctuating light outside, so uh, the green screen is kind of going in and out, but hopefully it works well. Anyways, getting to the point, today we've got some gameplay with the newest set legend, Glenn Rice, a former uh, Hornet, so back in the 90s, back when they were actually really good. Uh, he's got really, really solid stats, and he is the best uh, defensive small forward in the game right now. So I'm pretty psyched to get in some gameplay with him. We're using a couple of those legendary money balls that we got from the program over the yeah, All-Star Weekend program. So I'm ready to get in some gameplay with him. We will click highest overall and jump on in. Looks like he's probably our only elite net. We got a uh, out-of-position LeBron James as well. So we're going to go ahead and jump in some head-to-head. -head. We'll go against this 86 overall team and hopefully drop some buckets. This is definitely the best uh, Hornets card in the game right now, so I'm ready to get in some gameplay with him. And hopefully the tablet does not die while we're playing. I've been messing around with stuff with the capture card for a while, so we've been draining our battery a lot. First three, and he knocks it down. He does have an 89 three-pointer. Uh, this is just overall a really solid card, one of the best small forwards in the game. Um, I'm trying to think. The newest small forward is, I believe, is the Andrew Wiggins 96. So he's definitely, well, I won't say definitely better than that card, but he's. I like his stats better than I like the Andrew Wiggins card set. So I would, oh my, all right, we get blocked, and then we teleport to where the ball is, throwing up another three. Terrible timing, but he knocks it down anyways. All right, looking pretty good so far, so his only missed shot is when we got blocked. Uh, sorry if I seem a little distracted. I've been trying to work on stuff for a long time. Oh, get it to Glenn. Dang it, that's not what I meant to do. I wanted to dunk the ball, but he still knocks down the shot. All right. Okay, we're looking pretty good so far. Uh, let's see. Come on, Rondo. Give me another steal. All right. LeBron's just going to kind of sit there and watch him as he dunks the ball. Let's see. Where's Glenn at? Where you at, Glenn? Oh, spin on him. Spin again. Spin. Oh, nice dribble move. Ooh, okay. That was a nice little move to the basket. That was actually, that was pretty impressive. I was not expecting his handles to be that good. Uh, typically with a small forward, you don't have super nice handles, but thinking about what his stats were, I'm pretty sure he had pretty nice handles. Yes, there we go. Where's Glenn at? I don't want to dunk the ball with LeBron. Glenn, where'd you go? Oh, he's behind me. Nope, that's Rodney Hood. Oh, wide open in the corner. Nope, cross court. Ew, that was a dreadful pass. And we'll just pull up from right there. He has not missed a shot yet. This is a really solid card. Trying to make sure everything's all right with the way we're recording. My uh, The positioning of the face cam might be a little bit different from usual. Like I said, I've been messing around with some new stuff. And another terrible pass, but fortunately he hits it out of bounds. And it looks like everything's going pretty well with the recording so far. Might have to adjust the position for the face cam for future videos. But other than that, it looks pretty good. And he has not missed a shot yet. Knocking down another mid-range. This card just overall has really, really solid stats. Uh, I actually haven't done a whole lot of Legend gameplay card, at least on the day of in the past. But since we had those legendary money balls and it is a Hornets player... I figured I'd give it a try, and it is looking really good so far. So probably going to be doing some 2K videos later. And buzzer beater? No, his only missed shot of the quarter. Uh, let me know for 2K if you guys want to see my career or um, my career, my team, head-to-head -head against my friends, whatever it would be. Probably going to get into that later. We were playing uh, the new 2K17 on the Xbox last night. I have having a lot of fun with it so i'm looking forward to doing that with some of the guys we're gonna do one more quarter gameplay for you guys we'll go up against this 86 team come on come on click on it why why is it not clicking i'm so confused right now all right so apparently i can't play against the 86 team you know what we're gonna go big and go against this 91 
hopefully we don't get destroyed. Although our team is significantly worse, we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, but with the way this Glenn, what's his name, Glenn Rice card has been playing, I'm not too worried. Uh, he is a pretty consistent bucket getter. We're going to pull up from three right there and knocking it down again. I don't think we've missed any shots except for that buzzer beater attempt, which I am not even going to count because that's that's like a 1 in 50 chance of making it. Oh, come on, Rondo, take it. Oh, accidentally pressing the switch button instead of the steal button. All right, LeBron, get that board. Oh, that I did not want to pass away from him. Let's see. Nope. Come back, come back. They still haven't fixed half court in this or uh, back court in this game, so you can still go back court as much as you want. And he knocks down another shot. Oh my goodness, this card is crazy. All right, oh, grab that ball. Come on, come on, take it, Rondo. Take the ball. Oh, dang it. Ooh, all right. So he misses the dunk. Let's see where's Glenn at. All right, we're gonna we're gonna take it inside with him. Spin move. Oh, spin again. Oh, a little, oh, that was a tough shot. All right, that was not a great shot. Oh, come on, take it from him. Please, take the, what is going on? Why can't I steal the ball from Carl Anthony Towns? All right, let's see if we can get a steal with Glenn. No, Glenn is such a weird name. I've done two reviews for a guy named Glenn in the past week because we had Glenn Robinson as well. Uh, that's That's really unusual. All right. And we're going to pull up from three again, plus 10. He has not missed a three-pointer yet. I am really liking this card. I might end up picking him up on my alternate – or uh, no, this is actually my alternate account. Might pick him up on my main account if I can get the coins and if his price drops enough. I think the price of Legend Collectibles dropped a bunch today because we have Legend Packs out. And then also – um yeah just the price of legend players is going down because all those people have the legendary money balls so if you combine those two things that makes for cheap legends so i might be able to pick him up uh, i would definitely well actually i think we might have glenn robinson in his place so i'll have to decide that's so weird two the only two guys named glenn that i've ever played with in the game and they're both defensive small forwards that's that's really strange. Oh, and we miss our first three-pointer of the video. That is all right. We are coming up on the end. He did drop four throughout the duration of the quarter. So overall, just a really solid card. I would recommend this. Um, it's definitely an improvement over Glenn Robinson because he does have a way better three-point stat and just overall better stats. So I would say it's worth it to pick him up, especially if you're trying to max up out your lineup. I believe he's the best defensive option possible. And it looks like the tablet's about to die. So that's going to be about it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you did. And I will see you guys next time.